Hey ladies, so it's Mickey. So today I am going to do a vlog on what is going to be in Sophia's uh, suitcase. I'm sure I'm taking way too much stuff. We're going to be gone for 10 days. Um, I have a lot of extra stuff and it's mostly because she is slobbering like crazy. So I'm sure I'm going to have to change her at least once a day. And also, you know, you have to have that emergency uh, outfit ready just in case there's a leak or whatever. So here we go. Uh, hope you enjoy. Okay, so first let me start. This is her bag. It's a standard, um, what's it called? like carry-on size because that's the only size that we had for her okay and here is the table with everything laid out okay we're gonna start on this side I have some separates these are just shirts um, this one's for the Rangers game it says born to be a, a Rangers fan um, then just some random shirts so if she gets the uh, the shirts dirty but not the pants we have some extra shirts ready these are actually separates. Uh, these have shorts that go with them. So, or pants. No, these are shorts. So I have uh, four of those. These are uh, just in case it gets cold at nighttime, which I doubt it will, but you know, you can never be too careful. So it's just two little cardigans and this adorable, adorable little uh, trench coat that I got from Old Navy. I love the bow in the back. Then we have over here some sleepers my mom does tend to keep the house cold at night so I have some sleepers uh, just in case it isn't cold I have some onesies and then I have some little pants some PJ pants on the bottom I have Moby wrap just in case I'm also taking the ergo um, but I have this one just yeah just in case uh, this is her dress for the quinceanera uh, this is a bow that I bought from Etsy uh, to go with it. These are bloomers. She does have some bum genius that are the same color. So um, until she runs out of those, these are staying off. Let's see. <laughs> She's playing right now. These are a few dresses of hers. Um, I'm not sure if that one still fits her. So. That's why I'm taking a few of those. Just in case it is cold, I do have three warm weather outfits. A ton of bows of every color. I'm missing her coral one. I got to look for that. Um, socks. Shoes. Galore. She's going to wear these for the quinceanera or maybe these. I haven't decided. Probably these. These are actually... Um, shoeless or bottomless footless that she called them uh sandals so basically this is the top of the sandal her little toe goes in this and these strap around so there's nothing on the bottom of her shoe of her foot so pretty cute my uh cousin made these for her she has two little swimsuits there's this one and then there's this coral one which i love she looks awesome in coral Again, oh navy. <laughs> then we have a pair of swim diapers with ruffles on the bottom. These are absolutely adorable on her. And you know, babies usually get cold when they get out of the swimming pool. Um, so I have this little cute jacket that I call her Rocky Jacket. <laughs> we have some baby legs, bibs galore. These, this one is our favorite at the current moment because of the drill to keep it away from her neck. Wipes, um, what's called washcloths and towels. Over here we have her, um, what's it called? All her hygiene stuff, basically. Um, we have brush, nail clippers, because her nails are growing like crazy. Um, the nose Frida, comb, we're not going to use the toothbrush. I'm going to take that out. But we are using this teether thing. Um, I brush her gums and everything just to get her used to it before she gets teeth and I'm brushing her teeth. A syringe. We have uh, saline because, you know, your nose tends to dry and everything on the plane. This is California Baby. This is California Baby Eczema Cream, but it's also good for rashes and good for 
Um, like if she gets bit by any mosquitoes and stuff, it's supposed to be good for itching. Uh, we have, of course, our um, Angel Baby Bottom Balm for any, you know, prevent rashes with cloth diapering. Um, have her Aveeno Baby Wash Shampoo. We have over here, we have Gripe Water. We have instant repellent. This is the baby Gantic. The California baby um, sunscreen. Don't plan to keep her out in the sun too long, but you know, just in case. Um, lotion. I do have a hat. Um, it's in her diaper bag right now, though. But it will be going in this with this stuff. And then, last but not least, we have the sample packets of the Bum Genius um, detergent because um, I am I am going to be cloth diapering while we're gone. Um, it, the cloth diapers, obviously, with all this stuff, do not fit in her bag, so they're gonna have to fit in mine. Um, and yes, all of this does fit in the bag. I took it out of the bag to put it up here. I'm also going to be putting it all in space saver bags. So there will be extra room in there. So, yeah. So that is it. Say hi, Sophia. You can see all the drool on her neck, around her neck, because she's not wearing a bib right now. Um, but that's all that she's going to be taking as far as her bag goes. Um, I do have the diaper bag, but it's like general stuff, you know, uh, cloth diapers, wipes, um, an extra outfit, socks, and a little blanket uh, just in case she gets cold. It will also have my camera, uh, my camcorder in there because it's small. My husband's going to hold the Nikon camera. Uh, what else is going to be in there? That's pretty much it that's going to be in there. Uh, right? Yeah, that's pretty much it that's going to be there. It's pretty empty. Uh, oh, and I'm going to put a few toys in there. Uh, she's not going to have any <laughs> while we're home. So I, I got to put stuff in there for her. Some toys that she can play with. I'm also going to be renting, um, what's it called? An exosaucer. And I am borrowing a, uh, I'm borrowing a pack and play from a friend of mine. Uh, it's brand new. Uh, she's pregnant and she just got it and she's like, you can use it. You're more than welcome to use it. And I was like, that's awesome. Thank you. So yeah, I'm running the exosaucer from a company that rents them to, you know, people that travel with their babies and they don't have a crib. They don't have all this other stuff. So it's pretty cool. It's $24 for the week. Um, so that's awesome. I'm also taking the Chico stroller. Um, I decided on that just because it's lightweight and you know, it's going to be hot, so I don't want Sophia to be in the car seat all the time. So this is her Chico stroller. I love it. It's super, super simple to, um, you know, to maneuver and everything. Even with one hand, it's great. <laughs> so let's see. Taking a car seat and, oh, a travel boppy. Those are all the things that are going on the plane uh, that are Sophia's. So the majority of stuff is going to be Sophia's stuff. <laughs> but, you know, uh, she needs stuff to play with and whatever during our trip. So, yeah. All right. That is it for me. I hope that everything goes well for y'all. I'm really excited about our trip. We leave tomorrow and I will be vlogging as much as possible. I don't know if I'll get chances to put it all up at, while I'm gone, but definitely when I get back. All right, I'll talk to y'all later, bye.